Hey, Bruce, do you know what kind of love that I give Lois? I really don't care. Why are you bringing it up? Come on. Just humor me. Just for a moment. I don't do humor. Trust me, I know. I've tried for years. I've got a joke for you, Big Blue. Oh, yeah? What is that? Well, you want to know why all the villains are so obsessed and crazy over the Batman? What is that? Why, Joker? I don't know. He drives them batty. <laughs> <laughs> what a funny joke. That one tickled me well. Well, can I get on with my joke? Oh, baby blue, do tell. I always love a nice joke. Well, the kind of love I give Lois is super. I'm going to send you back to Arkham. And to you, Clark, I have to get my kryptonite that I have hidden anywhere and everywhere because I'm going to take you out. But Martha... <laughs> children. I work with children. It's my super dad hat. Welcome everybody. I'm RJ of the Nerdy Bruin here on this channel. We talk TV, movies, and everything in between. Oh, while drinking a cup of coffee. Now, if you like one of those things or all of those things, why don't you consider like, subscribing, and hit that notification bell and becoming a fellow Brewster. So today, fellow Brewsters, we are reacting to Superman and Lois, uh, CW Trailer 2. Now, for me, personally, I am a Superman enthusiast. I uh, grow, grew up on Lois and Clark, The New Adventures of Superman. And I've also grew up on the animated series. Um, during that time, I started getting into comics back way back when. I'm not going to age myself. But you could probably tell by The Death of Superman was probably my biggest arc. Um, there were other tie-ins leading up to Doomsday where there was some time travel involved. And Superman was with uh, the, the, glow, the gold glittery dude, Wave Rider, I think his name was. Um... And uh, it was all leading up to Doomsday appearing and then all the spinoffs of uh, the death of Superman or the death of Superman and um, all the other Superman storylines and then his resurrection. Uh, I was around to read all of that and it was mwah, it was gold. Um, Lo uh, not Lois and Clark, not with Dean Cain, but I love Dean Cain. Um, but the animated one had me really have a grasp. I feel like that was the best perfect representation of Superman. Um, and I really feel like Tyler Hol Holichin, I don't know how to pronounce his name, but I do feel like Tyler Holichin um, portrayed, a, uh, portrayed a very good Superman. That was needed definitely at the time because we had Henry Cavill and Henry Cavill definitely puts in the work and he has a, definitely a good look. But uh, the direction that was given for his Superman was definitely very weary. Um, and Superman is an optimistic individual. So he's not necessarily an optimistic individual, but he is a good person uh, down to his core due to his upbringing. So even though Superman was willing to save the day in Man of Steel, he was still in a place to... Um, uh, his, 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 his woe and worriness and his angst was very apparent and very heavy when, um, Superman knows that he's super and he is willing to do the right thing. But with that being said, um, let's watch his trailer. Beautiful, beautiful, yeah, kid farm fire. Tell you it sucks. Actually, <laughs> I think he kind of loved it. We came here as a family. It's too dangerous for them to know. It's more dangerous if they don't. 
So it's about his kids. No, we've seen Superman before. We've seen him. You told the boys you're Superman. Couldn't mind them anymore. This is gonna keep my family together. Bart, gotta tear it apart. All the times you were gone, you lied to me. You both did. Yo, this uh. Quality looks way better than any Arrowverse thing. The end of the world. The world will always be Loving the new so costume. Right now, this family needs you more. Superman and Lois, two hour premiere event, Tuesday, February 23rd. Stream free next day, only on the CW app. Hey! Let's keep it all the way 100. That was a wonderful trailer. Um. I must say, first of all, as I said during the trailer, it had very good cinema um, quality aspects uh, visually. That's one. Two, this is like Superman has a son right now in the comics of Jonathan Kent. Um, there's also Future State that is going on in the comics right now where Jonathan is the actual Superman of that time. But with that being said, that's pretty dope that... Um, he has two kids. Maybe one of them is adopted. I don't know what's going on with the blonde haired one. But uh, for him to have this family um, brings a different dynamic. There was um, just recently in the comics, I I'm going to say in the last two years, maybe three, um, before uh, the end of the run of the New 52 in DC Comics, uh, it was um, Rebirth. I was going to call it uh, the clock, but that was a thing too, um, Doomsday Clock. But there was the original Superman who was in a pocket universe who had his son who was still young. And um, he was the one that really had the characteristics, but he was hidden being a family man with uh, Lois and his son. So with that being said, you know, this is a, a very good look that he's a little bit older um, these kids are bigger and um, he has been Superman, but there's a different dynamic of we don't have to watch the growth between Lois and Clark anymore of will they, won't they, does she love Clark or does she love Superman, but she just loves the man and now they fully have grown to have a full family. Um, so I'm definitely stoked and excited for the show. Um, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. First of all, I also, before I get out of here, I want to say thank you to all the new subscribers for coming to the channel. Um, I'm very appreciative um, for the support. Um, what I'm trying to do is actually grow a community. Um, I really want to hear from you guys. I really want to talk these things out. And um, so this could be a safe place so we could just actually be nerds and even we could just talk about you know, just use the comic box for, for your place as long as it's within the content and long as it's um, not uh, being derogatory towards anyone, you know. I, I, I really just trying to do that and I appreciate y'all for being here um, and especially being at the bottom level. Um, as we grow, I have a lot of grand ideas for what I want the channel to be eventually. Um Let's say uh, Red Letter Media. <laughs> that, that's probably the, the goal. That's probably the goal that I, I want to definitely get to is Red Letter Media. But with that being said, I am going to bring this video to an end. Let your voices be heard in the comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Um, thank you for becoming a fellow Brewster. And with that being said, I want you to be you, do you, see a bigger picture. Have a fantastic day because you deserve it. This is that channel. Peace.